Last time on Dragon Ball Z. In case you didn't notice, I'm currently working on the recipe for the perfect Let's Play. While we uh, put this hot mama into the oven and wait, it, 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 it's on fire, isn't it? Well, it's looking like today's video is just about ready to be taken out of the oven. Let's just go check on this bad boy real quick. Oh my. Oh my fucking god, what have I done? No. <laughs> oh no. Now the world don't move to the beat of just one drum. What might be right for you may not be right for some. A man is born, he's a man of means. Well, hello there, my beautiful people. Sensitive Upload Man here, and you already know what we're here to do today. Much like our previous how-to, shameless plug, I'm here to break down for you guys everything you need to know about the art of Let's Plays, and by the time we're done, you'll be creating straight fire content of your own, but before we start, I feel like a disclaimer is necessary that any jokes, japes, or references that I might make to other people in this video or any other are 100% meant to be taken as personal attacks and should be treated 100% seriously. Oh, and I also forgot, to complement today's topic, I thought it would be nice to include some of its key features for the sake of the theme as well. Hold on a second here, guys. Haha, <laughs> now we're living, so without further ado, let's slide on down to the first part. Yeah, transitions are cool. Alright, just like theory videos, the first step to creating an amazing let's play is obviously coming up with the idea in the first place. Okay, okay, that's enough of this fucking gag. I at least want people to see my goddamn efforts here now. Now, idea conception. If we're talking a good old pocket monsters let's play here, the first step in developing it would be... Ah, uh, I love title cards. Now, obviously you want to pick the right combination of both game and format for maximum view effect, but luckily for you, I've already done the big boy work and we already have the five best game slash format combinations right here you can possibly find. You could even call it a top five. Now, what do you say we finally get some inception up in this b Number five. Pokemon Emerald Extreme Randomizer Nuzlocke Number 4 Pokemon Emerald Ultimate Randomizer Nuzlocke Number 3 Pokemon Emerald Really? Alright, we're, we're done here. Th that's enough of this. Mm, now, I already know you guys are expecting a loud yelling joke right about now, some nice hollering and hooting, but you know what? I'm not gonna do that. I'm a man of taste when it comes to comedy. I am above that low hanging fruit caliber of humor. I'm just gonna move on right on to the next step. Next step on the list is making sure your let's play looks nice and appealing to the eye. And to do that, you gotta get yourself some fine ass graphics. Or if you wanna be proper, you're better off calling it GFX or Graphical design. Either one will make you sound super duper cool and not mentally challenged, I promise you. Now what do you say we head on over to the shop and see how it's all looking so far? Okay, so we're finally here, but we gotta be quiet and respectful of our graphical designers who are currently hard at work as we speak. Hey, what's going on over here, pussies? How's my Pokemon Let's Play graphical design artwork GFX coming along? Well, you see, Mr. Crit Magnet, I'm currently working on the local for your Pokemon Emerald Ultimate Randomizer Soul Link vs. Taglock right now. Oh, Alright, let's just take a look at this here. Uh, hmm, I, I, I dig the vision, but it, it looks just a little bit off-center to me. Oh, really? Here, let me just see if I can adjust it really quick. Redo it. Wait, wait, what? Redo the whole thing. You're serious. Do I look like I'm joking? No. <laughs> Redo the whole goddamn thing, Dead. God, why, why, why do I even pay you? You aren't even paying me. It's called exposure, Ted. <laughs> well, hello there, Skizza, my man. What is shaking, my dude? Uh, well, I'm currently working on outlining your Emerald Really Randomized logo. Love it, my dude. Fan freaking tastic. I am about this movement but here. You're not even looking All at right, it. Alright, whatever you say, keep up the great work, my man. I, I want more lines. <sighs> okay, Ted, what have you got going over here now? Well, you see, since you rudely denied my logo a second ago, I thought I'd just start a bit on the background. Ted, 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 you're, you're, you're punking me, right? What is this? 
What is what? This background, it, it, it has color on it. And? Skiz's background also has color. And not to mention, your logo also had text in it. Call me crazy here, but I'm, I'm really starting to think that you're trying to copy him here. Oh my god, you've gotta be kidding. Get him out of here! Okay, now we're stepping into some familiar territory here. Now, uh, what are we gonna start with here? You know what? L let's start off with sound. Whenever you want a piece of your layout to slide up on the screen, whether it be your question of the day, light goal, what badges, I don't fucking know, dude. Uh, you can't just let that boy sneak up on there. You have to let it be known. And so to do this, I have the perfect technique. Insert Whoosh sounds. Whoosh. Lots of them is what I would say if I didn't have secret crit magnet technology as I so conveniently often do in these videos. This time, out on the market we have a brand new patented sound effect with a recipe that's been passed through my family for generations. And that sound effect to kill the whoosh sound is the... Johnny Test Whip Crack. Oh my god, it just it's just so beautiful. Oh sh shit, dude. <laughs> let's just do that again. <laughs> oh fuck. Anyways, this sound effect is known to really, really get the energy up, but be careful now. Use it more than seven times in a video and you'll actually summon the Lord Satan himself. Wait, how many whip cracks have- How many whip cracks have we used? Uh, 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 oh, uh, eight, huh? That's conveniently the same number required to uh, summon... <laughs> Hey there, buddy. How you doing? Well, that just about does it for today, guys. While Satan's currently holding me in limbo at the moment, I thought I'd take these waning seconds of my life to let you know that if you did in fact enjoy today's content, it would mean a ton to me if you left a like, let me know in the comments section below your favorite circle of hell, and if you're feeling extra saucy, share this tragedy of a video with a friend and subscribe if you're new in town. Not to mention, follow my Twitter for updates on when I'll be able to escape the afterlife and come drop a hello in the Discord server if you have the time. There's some big projects planned for the near future, but even then, expect part 2 to be coming on its way at some point in time, hopefully soon. And with that said guys, stay tuned, till then, you sexy, sexy individuals. Okay, Ted, I'm giving you one more chance here to knock my socks off. L let's see what you got. Well, since you've been spending so much time in the underworld, I managed to finish about six months ago. No colors, no text, just like you asked. T -t Ted, this is wonderful, but <laughs> wait, wait, what's that in the bottom left? Oh, that? That's just a Pokemon trainer spread. I thought it could add some nice perspective to the thumbnail. And I added T some Pokemon sprites as well. Trainer sprites? Pokemon uh, Sprites? Crit magnet? Using in-game assets and fucking graphics? Are, are you fucking kidding? Bro, the channel, the channel is fucked! We're, we're done! The channel is fucked!